is going on guys, Cyborg92 here, welcome to the channel, you subscribe, turn on bell notification, be part of the future channel, be the first one, drop a like, within 5 seconds now, you'll lose all your friends tomorrow morning, you don't want to willing to risk it for the biscuit, you already know what it is, and hopefully everyone have a good day, don't forget to stay home since this pandemic is really scary, and try not to go out as much as possible, hopefully everyone have a good day, happy Friday to you guys, and if you guys didn't know, I also have a creator code too, please use my creator code in the item shop, it's capital yt cyberhorn 92 all capital, no spaces, please help me, it will help me in the channel over time, and hashtag ads, by the way, today is Friday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, I usually make train card game content, if you guys are not into it, and don't have to watch it, if you guys want to support me, I would gladly appreciate it, help me grow my watch timer so I can get ads on my video, Today's video, I'm going to be talking about Yu-Gi-Oh! Tearless Battle City. No one had never made this video before, so I'll, I'll try to be the first one. So yeah, this is actually going to be my first time doing a tier list, and I'm looking super excited. It took me so many, like half an hour to make this whole tier list. Get find a character and much as possible. So you guys didn't know Battle City. Battle City is basically Kaiba also hosts a tournament. Anyone like who entered the tournament, the top competitor, competitor will up against to the next round. Of like the biggest like represent who will win that certain tournament so kaiba you guys didn't know this is kaiba right here and let's rank the video um the character that's my my opinion you guys don't hate me so yeah i'm gonna have to say yugi moto of course because he's number one um he, there's nothing to explain he's the best he, he's the heart of the cards and he know what he's doing and uh, yeah he need to go back to ancient egypt as well you guys don't know about you guys please watch it's actually really fun and entertainment as well. We got Yami Yugi, they're actually similar. This is the little Yugi, this is the big Yugi, aka Pharaoh. And yeah, they both work together pretty good. Nothing explained from there. Um, we got Mokuba, um, he doesn't really duel, I don't think. Uh, you guys let me know in the comments. It's been a long time to watch Yu Gi Oh! I would not put in the comments, but he usually cheer with his um, brother most of the time on his side or um, with the others like Yugi and all his other friends as well. I'm gonna put support right here as well. We got Jolie Wheeler. Jolie Wheeler is good. I would not put in the rank. Oh, I have to probably have to put probably right here as well. Now we got um, Bakura. Bakura is evil. He has some evil in ha um, his half part and some of them um, is good part. He's actually a really good duelist as well. I'm probably going to put him right here as well. We got Kaiba, of course. Uh, he's saying I'm rich, man. I own every card. Like, I'm here to win. And also, that like I have money, so screw the rules. You already know. Um, so he can be a little bit like um, toxic most of the time. And he really want to be number one. It's very possible, but you're up against the king of game. Obviously, Yuki and... No, Pharaoh and Yugi as well. Now we got, um, oh yeah, we got Bakura already done. We got um, Serenity, that's Joey's sister. Um, they support each other. She doesn't really do, I don't think, but she usually support as well. She's kind of cute, by the way, as well. <laughs> Alright, we got t um, t um, Tia or something like that. I think that's her name. I'm really sorry. I really have bad pronunciation. Anyway, she also support as well. I don't think she really played the game. I believe she played once at the episode during the ice, um, during um the simulator of Noah. I mentioned about Noah. He is a very scary kid, very smart kid as well. I would probably put him right here as well. Now we got Bandit Keith. Um, he also good, but he cheats as well. So I'll put it right here. He play machine stack as well. Any cheater always have to be bottom because cheater never wins. Sure it does, but like you will get karma over time. You already know what it is. Now we got um this guy, the cheater rare hunter. He played Exodia. You guys remember he used always Exodia, always draw, and then always take someone cards away. And he just marked his cards of Exodia. You guys remember that episode? Now we got um this Jinzo guy I forgot um yeah, yeah uh yeah I forgot anyways um so I'm gonna put him at the bottom because he's actually like um good but like he his team and like support him like tell him what's um your their opponent um hands most of the time so basically looking the hands telling them most knowledge as well 
We got Tristan, of course. He's actually a really chill guy. He's usually wrestling support. Help the, the team out and support. I don't think he do it before. I might not think. He probably do it one of the episodes of the um, Ice Barrier as well. In the um, simulator as well. Now we got... Um, this guy, this is the dance guy. I, I don't remember the top of my head. I have a horrible memory. Anyways, you guys. So, I believe his name is John or Johnny or something like that. I believe so. Um, he's kind of like a sim. He's like seem nice and like like brag about it. So, I'm probably going to put right here as well. Now, we got... Um, we got my Valentine's. Of course, she, she's over in the past, but she actually played well. So I will probably have to put her right here in the middle. Not like, yeah, well, I really want to put her right here, but like, I feel like she might be in this category as well. We got um, Rex Raptor, aka the dinosaur player. Um, probably have to put it right here, I will have to say. Um, he's not that bad in dinosaur, but yeah, I totally respect that. Uh, we got Weevil Underwood, the uh, guy, um, plant insect. It's not too bad, he doesn't cheat, I don't think, so I have to put him right here as well. Now we got, um, uh, the interesting part, Merrick. Merrick took people's souls away, is very scary. I don't think he cheat, I don't think. He have very good, um, strategy plays as well, so I will have to probably have to put it right up here. Right there. Um, we got more rare hunters, um, th these guys, um, probably have to put at the bottom, I would have to say, because I feel like they cheat, but I don't think so, so probably right here, I'm still debating, uh, I'm actually going to probably gonna put them right here, they're actually not that bad, unless I change my mind, um, we got Seto Kaibo, the AK the fodder, uh, I believe he played Exodia before, as well, um, I wouldn't say he cheat. I don't think he would try to like you know eliminate um, Yugi friends and the other one because they was trapped in the simulator as well. So I'm probably gonna put it right here as well. We got Duke Devlin. He's not the greatest at the game. He know what he's doing. So I'm probably gonna have to put right around here as well to support. Um, we got Bone. Um, he's okay. Uh, probably gonna put him right here. He plays zombies. Um, but yeah, we got this guy. This guy seems nice, but not really. I feel like he's a simp, basically, be nice to girls and try to date, you know. But I don't know, anyways. Uh, he played ninjas, his strategy is actually pretty good. I was really scared that he used this one of the nin ninja monsters, it's actually a real monster, not a hologram. And yeah, I just had to put it right here as well. It's actually, really scary. The monster took over her, and it was like. I just have nothing to say. I was so worried. We got the Yuka Kaiba Corp um, machine. That's actually a thing. I actually Google it. It's actually thing part of the season and the episodes. It's basically a machine that's literally no any cards that any player that have in the game. So copy of their decks and then repair. So I would not say that one. I feel like it would be cheating, but not. Um, I'll have to probably be right here, like, you, you, come on, it's technology. Technology is way smarter than most of us, most of the time. And technology help us over, um, get things done, but feel like spoil as well. Um, we got the uh, Rare Hunter, um, I'm not quite sure he cheated, but somehow Feral or Yugi, they defeated him with Slight for the Sky Dragon. Um, that draw power, that was like that maxi deck out, so... I will have to probably have to put right down here. I don't know. He seemed like a bad guy as well. Um, the fisherman guy. He's actually really cool and chill. Um, you should support his friends. Um, he's a good sportsmanship. I will probably have to put him the tier B part at this one. Arcana. I believe that's his name. Um, uh, it's actually kind of scary what he did. Try to like locked up the enemies um feral or yugi around that time so i'm probably going to put right here anything that's evil always at the bottom um these two guys the penguin um i forgot their name i cannot remember the top of my head um they're the bad guys always put at the bottom of course i forgot his name he's a really chill guy 
I believe, but he worked for um, the Merrick. But I don't think he doesn't harm anyone, so I'll probably have to put it right here. Uh, tier C. Um, this is the Millennium guy. Um, I would have to say put it probably like he know what is he doing. He can see the past and the future. Like I, I believe so. He know what is he going like no, no like like help out the Feral where he need to go back in time and uh, yeah. So I would probably have to put it right here as well. And this guy, the evil guy, of course, I forgot his name, but yeah. Let me know what you guys think about this whole tier list. Um, you guys let me know if I forget any characters, what you guys think about this video. Um, this is actually my first time, do not expect this is perfect for me. And you guys made the video all the way to the end, what to say thank you. And this is Sabahorn92 is signing out.